Hello friends, we are discussing about the what is the new upgrades in Laravel 9. So we already published two three videos about that and we are discussing each and every upgrades with a proper example so that we can get better understanding. So playlist link are provided in the description section. I will recommend you please see the full playlist so that you can understand what is the actual new things in Laravel 9. Right. So in this video, we are going to discuss about the interesting things of uh, new upgrades actually. This is the controller grouping. So we actually heard about the route grouping and in this video, we will going to discuss about what is the controller grouping. This is the absolutely new in Laravel 9, right? So in our previous uh, day, we just created a controller that is the post controller and if you go to the post controller just go here you can see there is two functions and we are creating these uh, routes now i want to create a controller group so that we inside this controller we will write all the routes related to this controller right so now uh, simply just uh, go to the post controller and i am not going to change these things i just want to print something suppose simply write return uh, from save function actually I want to show you how controller grouping works right so simply we don't need mass things we just uh, want to see the concept and this is from get data okay no problem so we have the two uh, routes that is the save and get data and simply just change the gate save and get this will be sort it will be helpful save and get and we have the two functions so if you just uh, go to the save functions so simply just go to the save url will get from save functions and if you just uh, go to the gate you will get this is from gate data right now the same thing will happen but we'll use a controller grouping concept right so how we can do this simply just create a group uh, suppose route and simply write controller uh, sorry controller and here and just write the name of the controller that is the post controller and the class right so in these things actually post controller and class and i will create a group so simply write group and inside that group i will create a closer functions actually inside a group just create a function and inside this function we will write all the routes so just go here and sorry this this will be the syntax okay and just copy these things and paste it here okay and as we are using the route grouping with the post controller so we don't need to write these things also so simply just write save and uh, the save methods name and here also just write uh, the gate and the gate method name right so simply just url and the functions which actually i am calling so now just refresh here it will just uh, going to read the same things and if i just uh, use save here we are getting the same things that means the functionality is same but the structure is little uh, organized means in your large project suppose you have uh, 30 or 40 or maybe more than 50 controllers so that you will get all the controller related functions in the same group so that it will more helpful to find your routes actually and along with this i want to show you another things suppose uh, this is the also new things so that is if i just uh, go to the terminal and i want to see a route list so how can i do this so simply php artisan route list and it will see all the routes right so this is the gate for defined color post is defined color and if i just uh, create defined different routes suppose uh, let's change to see actually suppose i am uh, writing here the delete and uh, or you can write the put method so if you just refresh this again we'll get the delete in different 
and uh, put in different color get in different color right so just undo this it will actually not happen but i want to show you how this uh, route listing are changed and from this we can get directly the controller name and the function name from the route list also so this is the actually the new things in laravel 9 also so in this video we can understand how to group your controller and uh, what is the changes in the route list actually right so i think you will like this video and still if you have any queries about this video please comment in a below comment section so next day we will going to discuss about another new upgrades in laravel line that is the rendering a blade string right so please like and subscribe this channel for upcoming video and don't forget to see full playlist laravel 9 updates right so we will get the more understanding from there step by step we will get the full uh, features of full upgrades in laravel 9 right so thanks for watching this video and have a good day